Hi, I'm Dan Monopoly with LaCroix here at uh, Embedded Systems Conference Silicon Valley and we're talking about our new Logic Studio USB Logic Analyzer that you can see here. This is a 16 channel, 100 megahertz, 1 gigasample per second sample rate Logic Analyzer. Plugs into any Windows PC and gets this nice software interface on the display. Uh, it supports serial data protocols like I2C, SPI, and UART. We can trigger on those protocols and we can decode the data on the fly as it goes here. And really what you're looking at is uh, a variety of signals that we can uh, capture and display. Uh, and there's a lot of nice features in this software and it's very easy to use. Basically, if you can use a computer mouse, you can pick up this piece of software and use it yourself. Uh, so simple where if I want to move the waveforms around, I just left click and I drag it. If I want to zoom in to see more detail, all I gotta do is turn the wheel on the mouse and I get a nice zoom. So if I want to bring it back to where I started, I hit this button up here, and now I'm back in the sort of default setting where I can see all my waveforms. What's really interesting is uh, things are a little bit crowded here. I have a great magnifying tool. I click this magnifying glass and I get this special zoom box right on the screen. And without changing my main capture window, I can zoom in to see a lot more details on my waveform and really see what's happening in my system. As I stop the trigger, I can zoom in and really see everything that's happening there. Another nice feature is I have been capturing data for some time. I have an icon that looks like a rear view mirror in your car. That means we're gonna look at all the waveforms that are in the past. So there's a built-in buffer and we'll save up to 100 waveforms that you previously captured. So I can click this button uh, and I get this slider bar and I can slide through here and as you see, I'm, I'm in stop mode and I'm looking through a history of previous captures. So maybe a problem happened a little while ago, I can go back and find it and really simplify how I debug. Uh, so that's another nice thing there. And one more really great feature I think is the ability to decode various protocols. So here I have, it says SPI bus and I'm reading hexadecimal values off the bus. And right below it, I look at the data and the clock and the chip select lines associated with that bus. And I can expand them and collapse them as I, as I want to look at them differently. And I have the same kind of functionality uh, with our regular parallel bus. As I zoom in, I can double click to center this and zoom in with my mouse wheel. You can see that there are values on this bus. It's a simple counter in this example. But below it are the individual bits that collapse into that hex value. So it's really about a simple interface with basic mouse operation to look at 16 digital channels with 100 megahertz, one gig sample per second, and I squared C, SPI, and UART protocol support. Thank you. <laughs>